means it's cold. Yes. Uh, people are going to have to get creative. And they are. Especially this winter, yeah. People are certainly finding ways to keep eating out, even if it is winter in Wisconsin. And Lori Frederick is a writer with OnMilwaukee.com. She's also the host of a podcast called... Food Crush. Yes, and she had some uh, interesting insight on the restaurant industry this season. The whole idea here is share lemonade, right? Life hands you lemons, make lemonade. Tell us the restaurant industry, not a good year, but what is the upside that you've seen? Restaurants are making it possible, I think, for us to embrace the winter a little bit more, um, you know, setting themselves up with things that also, you know, hopefully bring in business and keep them around, you know, for the duration of the winter. Tell us what it, some of the best patios you've seen or just the way, you know, restaurants are getting inventive. There's a lot of patio heaters. We're also seeing though places that are like putting out like little enclosures um, to keep people warm. So there are lots of like everything from igloos to greenhouses um, to little private dining spot. Elder and Rhyme is a new Scandinavian restaurant on the west side and they have come up with this idea of a stuga. You can rent a stuga. So that's a Swedish word for cabin. Um, cool. And you know, Scandinavian people are well known for huga. Like, yeah. let's get cozy in the winter, you know, put on your warm socks, light some candles. I think the idea of, you know, getting huga in a stuga would <laughs> <laughs> be a good idea. It's not a not exciting time to dine, even if you're doing carry out, um, because so many places are really thinking creatively about this. I'm telling people, like, go out and do these things because they will never happen this way. Food and beverage and bringing people together is like one of the things that give all of us joy. And I think that what we need to do as consumers is really just embrace what's out there, what's being offered, you know? Yeah, things are different, but you know, you can, you can go and snuggle up with a blanket with your honey bun or whoever, <laughs> you know, on a hot, on a warm patio. Um, you can get this huge carryout spread, bring it back to your house and, you know, eat it with your people. You can, you can have all of these experiences and, you know, definitely do it because, you know, if, if all goes well next winter, you know, we'll just be eating in restaurants again.